payments is that it's hot right now. We moved about $70 billion last year across 190 countries, 24 currencies, and it feels like we're just getting started. 10 years in business and the opportunity just continues to grow. And what I mean by that is, um, with all the success that we've had, we see a lot more, you know, checkout is our core business, and that's where most of it has been. But we're, with all these trends around social networking, virtual goods, digital goods, um, applications, developers, right at the center of that, uh, we can't we can address it all ourselves. So last year, in November, we launched our developer platform. We're the first uh, uh, the, uh, major payments company uh, to open up our platform with third-party developers. And they've responded in droves. We've got 25,000 developers signed up since November. We have more than 100 live payment applications that we wouldn't have been able to do ourselves. And, and uh, mobile is a huge part of it. There's a lot of demand in the mobile space. We've even built our own send my app, the latest one we launched last week, on top of our platform. What's the cash situation? Could you talk a little bit about how much, you, how much money you're making from this? How much money we're making? Yeah. I don't know if we can talk about the platform piece alone, but you know, we're- These questions aren't prepared. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's good. Uh, you know, we're, we're, this is not a, a, a platform piece, is not a revenue investment, this is a strategic investment. Yeah. We, uh, as opposed to the $650 billion that we call e-commerce around the world, we want to grow that pie to be the $30 trillion consumer spend every day. And that's what's, what it's about. So we can't do that ourselves. We want to partner with developers, give them the tools, as well as all of the other things that need to be successful. And together, we, we think we can address that $30 trillion. So you're going to make any announcements at demo today? Uh, so uh, there's a couple. Uh, the first one is, we're, uh, you know, we see demo as a great place to showcase some of the hottest innovations that could turn into great businesses. And that's valuable for us. So we launched a developer program, a uh, developer challenge, a contest last November. And we're here today to announce the winners of that developer contest. It was a very successful developer contest. Uh, we're, we're really excited about it. But we're also here to, uh, to announce a startup accelerator program. Uh, we think it takes more than just technology, and we're hearing this from our developers, more than just technology to make these payments ideas successful. So the startup accelerator program is about enabling developers with all the other things they need to be successful. That could include funding, that include, it could include commercial deals, connections, help on, on, on the strategy. So whatever they need in that critical incubation phase. Okay. So are you going to call them up and introduce the winners? Well, uh, absolutely. Um, for, let me take a, a quick second to okay. talk about uh, some of our mobile initiatives since these guys are yeah. just here talking about mobile. Uh, you know, we've been in mobile since uh, 2005, so five years now. Um, and, uh, you know, we haven't really seen much happen until last year. You know, uh, eBay is now the leader, the global leader in, in mobile commerce. And, and PayPal, uh, we're seeing that trend as well. Uh, 2008, we moved $25 million in payment volume. In 2009, that number jumped up to 140 million payment volume. So that's a six-fold increase. And in 2010, we're seeing that accelerate even further. We think the platform is a critical part of making that, uh, allowing that to go as far as it could to its full potential. And we're even eating our own top. We built our latest iPhone app on top of it. And, and, and so we're, we're really excited about what's going on in mobile. I, I want to highlight that I think 2010 is definitely the year of mobile and, and mobile payments. People are now willing to spend on, on mobile phones in ways we've never seen before. And, and so everyone here should take advantage of that. It's great that you're so, uh, yep. on, the, uh, on the winners, uh, so uh, let me talk a little bit about the process. We didn't know what to expect. Hey, this is hard to innovate in. These were new tools. Um, we expected 100 or so submissions. We got 650 submissions. So I want to definitely thank the team that I have that worked on this. Wow. They, they busted their butt to, to try to accommodate all this. 650 submissions. Um, we had the community, and this is a, a new process for us. We had the developer community, our developer community, uh, identify the finalists. Uh -huh. So the, through our website, the, the developer community identified the finalists, and then we had a distinguished panel of judges uh, choose the winners, the two winners, which we'll announce today. And that included Roloff Boga of Sequoia Capital, Mark Andreessen, uh, uh, Pierre Vidiar, of course, founder of eBay. Small Scott, names. Uh, yeah, well, these are big names, right? Scott Cook, founder of Intuit, yep. and Scott Thompson, uh, our, our president uh, of PayPal. And so the winners, uh, starting with the runner-up is an application called App Packer. Uh, uh, and I'll, you know, App Packer, I'll, I'll, I'll hold on a second, I'll explain these in a second. Uh, and then the second one is Rentalink. And uh, as opposed to me telling you what these guys do, I'm going to invite them up here uh, to tell us in a few seconds. Right. Hey, uh, 